So we have put one screw in now, and we want to make sure that it can still go back and forth this way a little bit, so it's loose enough to do that. Start on the gantry side. You'll have these two pieces. We'll go on the side like this. We're going to be putting bearings here, here, and in these locations. This is a groove so you can tighten up the bearing, the lower bearing, onto the bottom slide or the bottom rail. So this is the gantry side. You're going to um, put the bearings in this location, this location, and these two locations. As I said before, these grooves are used to tighten up against the bottom of the rail. You're going to use one of these um, 2 inch, 3 8 inch um, screws. You'll have four of them for each side. That means you'll have eight total for both sides. You'll have eight of these for one side, eight of the smaller washer, or I'm sorry, four of the smaller washer, and four of the large washers. And for nuts and the, the V groove, or it's also called the W um, profile uh, bearings. And the bearings are going to be riding on this rail here. Okay, so let's assemble. So the bearing goes on first, then the smaller washer. The smaller washer allows the, some space between the smaller washer and the larger washer so the bearing doesn't um, hit this larger washer and stop the bearing because this is going to be very tight. And then a large washer and we'll go ahead and Put it through. Wait, I'm going to get this side. And now we can put a smaller washer on and the nut. And with this one, we actually will use another large. So I'm going to update you on the, on the part, parts. Because this groove is a little, little, little bit large. And it's going to be resting actually on the bottom of the groove. this nut you want to make sure that the bearing is pressed firmly against the rail. You'll need to add these bearings to this side as well. Use the same procedure as you did on the other side.
y-axis rail support will be attached to this part. You'll sit on this sort of ledge and you'll see there's four holes that, are, that it's used to attach. The same for the other side. So let's put it together. On this lower hole, you'll need a one and a half inch screw. On this side, you'll need one and a half inch screws and cross balance.